What's going on guys, Kyber Jones for you another new video today on the wonderful day of Thanksgiving. What you're watching in the background is a 16 kill mega, I believe it, it is a win indeed, and it is also solo, so you know, you can watch that in the background as I ramble on about this wonderful time of the year called Thanksgiving. I wanted to take the time to actually just discuss my Thanksgiving traditions and kind of figure out what you guys do because I'm honestly pretty curious because I know like I know a lot of my friends traditions are uh, similar but there are differences and you know it's always it's kind of nice to just know like what other people do it's, co it's cool to know that kind of stuff so I want to know like what you guys do if you travel to different places if people come to your house um if you have a like, huge like huge feast with your entire family or if it's like smaller uh groups of people maybe you have a couple of dinners i don't really know i know what i have and i don't really know what you guys have so let me know in the comments just just blow up the comments out of this video because i'll be reading and responding to literally every single one um but you know secondly this is a very important question to me i don't i don't know why but i think it's an important question to some of you guys too what dessert do you have on thanksgiving because this will make or break your night depending on the dessert you have i personally my family we have pie and i'll get into that in a little bit but it, it is the perfect thing to have and i would have it no other way but let me take this time to talk about my tradition basically i have some prop i don't personally have my family has some property um out of the city you know 30 plus minutes away not not a crazy drive but um you know it's, it's like 45 minutes away or so uh but we drive up there or i don't know if it's up regardless whatever we drive there um and basically everyone from my dad's side actually also we all meet up there and have a giant family thanksgiving it's always been this way ever since i can remember i honestly wouldn't have it any other way because it's fantastic because you don't actually get to see a lot of your relatives that much especially if they live around your state or not maybe even in other states you don't get to see them that much so it's nice to see them all in one place and you know i have all those weird kind of kind of awkward funny conversations with them um everyone you know for this for the entire day but um yeah we all meet up and we have a giant feast and you know we have the traditional food smash potatoes stuffing uh freaking obviously turkey um, a bunch of other things as well on, you know, a little, a couple little more dessert items that we have on the table and some other, and uh, various amounts of drinks and other things that we consume during this eating holiday. <laughs> no, it's not just an eating holiday. I, I, it means more to me than that, but that's, you know, all main activity in this holiday. And secondly, we have a, you know, since it is a large property out there, I mean, it's a farm, so you have a lot of acreage a lot of space on the property so we're kind of expected not expected i mean you're not like told to but we're you know, it's kind of a, a thing that we do where we go outside and just have fun uh various sports activities even though it's freezing we still we're still out there just being stupid and doing stuff outside i don't know we're, whatever you do in the woods slash just open area um which is always really fun i always have a really good time uh doing that just screwing around honestly um, and then you come in for dinner and we eat dinner and after dinner, this is the important part for me, the part that changes lives, is the, the absolute amazing pie that we have. It's homemade, people bring it in, I don't know really who, like a bunch of pe different people in my family bring it in, or bring it, uh, to, to the dinner. And uh, we have to wait, obviously, after dinner to eat it, and everyone's literally thinking about that the entire. There's questions floating around the room about the pie. Um, you know, people are just staring at it. I, I swear, like I'm not even exaggerating. That's actually happening. Like people are, they're focused about this pie. Um, but yeah, we have all different flavors of pie, and it is actually the best moment when you're eating that pie with some ice cream, maybe some whipped cream. Actually, definitely some whipped cream. Uh, you gotta go whipped cream. But you're eating that pie. I I usually go like cherry. There's always there's like cherry, blueberry, pecan, pumpkin, um, some other. Uh, just, uh, I can't think of apple. Yeah, that's another one that we always have. But you know, there's just tons of different flavors of pie, and it is the greatest. Sit in front of the fire, eat some pie. Night's complete. I don't need anything more out of that night. I I am I'm done. I can go to sleep. Um, I don't. But you know, I I'll. Uh, I'll, I'll take that as a victory. Um, but honestly, let me know in the comments uh, what you guys do, because I will be reading every single one of them, like I said. Um, let me know what you guys do. What kind of uh, Very important that you answer the question of what kind of dessert do you have, because I don't know why it's important to me, but answer it, because it's amazing. 
Anyways, hopefully you guys did enjoy this. Leave a like if you did. S subscribe, I can't speak. Subscribe for more content like this. And have a wonderful Thanksgiving afternoon slash evening. Peace out.